How's it going, you guys? and a couple of Democrats have kind of come together to form this coalition that's just blocking anything from getting there. So, <laughs> and, uh, but, you know, but we're still working on that. I think that we've got some ideas in the works. We're trying to get them on board with some of them. Mm -hmm. But, uh, but yeah, I just want to let you know we're still working on that. That's what we we're trying to get that. through. So. Hey, it takes two -thirds is there right right to, pass to raise anything. taxes. And, and Sorry if I get that to you. Oh, it's just, I mean... Uh, first district. For uh, okay, that's not us. So I have a proposal, guys, because my senator is actually, um, even though he's got a D next to his name, is a Republican, apparently. But yesterday, yeah, I, I just talked oh, to those guys there, and I said, you know, if, if I uh, they said, you can get your senator to come out and bring you in yeah. by appointment, which is still open, and if they're still in there. How's it going, gentlemen? Thanks for serving us. Hey, let's let these guys through. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy the sunshine, you guys. <laughs> and, your fa and your families. <laughs> and your parents. Well, I mean, what happens if like 98% of Americans started doing their taxes overseas? Just because it was cheaper. You know what I mean? Smart. I can't go to school, I ain't even that cool Cause oh, I ain't got the money to rule you Like they do, they do How much does it cost to get a vote from you? Maybe you could choose to do the right thing Well, he just went inside and ignored me. <laughs> <laughs> again. Ruth from Wisconsin supports your, your plight here. Thank you, Ruth. Thank you. Thank you, Ruth. Thank you, Ruth. Thank you, Ruth. Thank you pizza time. <laughs> Thank you. Pizza time. You are awesome. You know what? We, we've, got, we've got all of their phone numbers. Tell her. Tell her we support her, too. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is the fifth hey. Yeah. The fifth one? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. And that, I mean, you guys are here again tomorrow, right? Yeah. <laughs> yes, we are. No one? Thanks. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Hey, Nick. Nick, turn around. Show us that pizza. Let's see the pizza. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, real hard. Let's get this. Wisconsin. Ruth oh, from Wisconsin. Thank you. Thank you. You are feeding oh, you us at USA. Vegetarian. What's wrong with you people? <laughs> I'm just you can pick it off. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get in the light here and be like. Ruth, we love you. I am Devin from Tacoma Uncut. We got Olympia Uncut here. We got Seattle coming out tomorrow. Thank you for the pizza. We are hungry working out here. We were locked out of our capital today, which is not fair. We can't get any of our representatives. We can't get any lobbyists. We can't get anyone to let us into this building. So. We're gonna camp out here for a while and play some music and thank you for the pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> thank you, Ruth. Thank you, Ruth. <laughs> Stop walking. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I, I would like to make a request to talk to the uh, administrator from the PA. Because I actually know the WAFs and I know they know the WAFs and they should be Excuse informing me, you guys Excuse of the law. Me. And they're not. Can you get us in? Can you get us in? Thank you. Can I go in with you? You have a card. Are you in GA? 
Uncut National did. Yeah. And they mailed them to you? Uh, they're on their website. In the blog section. Yeah, I, pr I printed them this morning. Yeah. I only had time to make about 30 of them, so I've got a few left. It's just you almost have to have glasses to be able to read it, but yeah. I got six per page that way. No, that's much better to do it that way. Is your rent bit paid? Name of our nation off your filthy corporation. Get the name of our nation off your filthy corporation. It's for Bank of America. They don't represent America. They represent the Cayman Islands, man. They represent themselves and their corporate greed, and we don't want that. That's not what America is about. America is about the little guy coming together. All the little guys coming together. Making something of ourselves. And they're stopping us from doing that with the corporate greed. So get the name of our nation off their filthy corporation. It's as simple as that. Bank of the Cayman Islands, I'm totally okay with that. Bank of America, fuck that. <laughs> so I'm gonna call them. Uh, what they're doing right now is illegal. Hey, we're getting... They're assuming a crime is gonna, we're gonna break a law in terms of the wax before we've even entered and they're just, they're, they're letting certain people in. Like I've seen young, cute girls go in. They won't even let us use the bathroom. They're letting lobbyists no, it's in. The they're letting lobbyists so, in, and they're not letting us in. I quoted the, the wax to them. I quoted, you know, like precedent in terms of, of you know, it's a, illegal for them to assume guilt for something. And they I'll tell them you're down here, and I'll see if you can. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Can so you please yeah. go inside. So who? So can you get, get a clear explanation of who can come in, go into the building, and who can't? You can uh, people who have business in the building. Uh, I have business. We got business. Let, business. Let him talk. Tomorrow, the building. Tomorrow morning, the building is going to be opened up again. Okay. Uh, so in light of today's of activity, huh? okay. in the light of today's activity, we felt it was important to have a cooling off period. Uh -huh. So that's why the building, uh, in terms of ensuring that there's safety at hand for everybody, right. it'll be reopened up in the morning. So um, that gives everybody an opportunity to kind of regroup, cool down. So what's the definition of business before the legislature? Uh, people who actually are working here in, in the form of the legislators, people okay. who have to work in the building, <laughs> and uh, people who are staffers uh, for those respective uh, bodies. Can media come Are there votes going on? Uh, only if they have business in there. So, so, so if, like, like if Brad Chant, if an Olympian reporter wants to come in and cover the fact that people can't go in and out, um, he's welcome to come down here and do that. Okay, can you go in and do that? Uh, I'm a, I'm a photojournalist for US Uncut. Can I go in? If Brad Shannon and you actually have real business in there, that's a different story. But it's just informing, informing, informing the Americans. Real business. It is, there, and then you'll be able to exercise that yeah. tomorrow morning. Are there votes going on? I'm trying to figure out what real, what, what, what is the line between real business. I'm trying to figure out a clear line so we can, so I can let his. Uh, the people are confused, right? So, so if a legislator wants somebody to come in, can they come in? For conducting state's business. Right. So, so but a legislator came out here and said, I, I, um, I would like everybody, you know, for this is people's business, business, not just state business. I want them to come into my office. Can they? Can they do that's that? Gonna, that's going to be their responsibility to take care of. We are practicing, you know. Putting democracy in action. Yes. The practice of democracy isn't state business, and that's a sad. Complaint. It is. Yeah. And we're so not sad. denying See, that's you your argument. ability to do go that. Yes, you are. You're denying you our ability get, to go in and down, talk to our legislators. Down, I want to go in and write a letter to my can, legislator. You can do that tomorrow. I, I, I write it out here. here. Well, I, how about why did you walk? But Americans don't stop for a day. Just. Are doing it now. The thing is, is that building technically doesn't close till seven. Mm -hmm. So to disallow certain types of individuals because of their political affiliation or whatnot is that is a civil rights violation. Legal under constitutional state law, as well as the WACs that govern, you know, public buildings and grounds. One cannot assume that a rule is going to be broken or crime committed before the fact. If we were to go in. And then we decided to do something that clearly interfered with public safety and in other ways challenged the WAC, even if it still need to be challenged later on. And that was clear. At that point, you could say, okay, now we are asking you to leave. 
but, but not but before. Informed, you can't. They I cannot understand exclude everything you're saying, before the fact. But in light of today's activity, we are not affiliated with those decision, who were here earlier. I wasn't here. We're not affiliated at all. I wasn't here earlier. I worked all day. They all went home. They're eating dinner. I arrived. I had nothing. They're all gone. So I don't have no idea what happened today. Well, the building is going to be open in the morning. I heard on the news that some mental health workers who wanted to see the governor and they were arrested when they didn't stop where the patrol said no you cannot enter well, so that's, and that I also factual. heard a few sure other. There are a lot of stories floating around. So, well, 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 can you tell us what so happened then? That, is, that doesn't make it factual. So you well, cited events. Can you tell us what happened? Say that again. You cited that what you cited what exactly? You said in light of what happened. Can you tell us what happened inside? We had to arrest people who were behaving uh, unlawfully. Okay. Which what, what, created what a uh, real disturbance in the building. I had a trooper get uh -huh. assaulted during uh -huh. the course of that action. Oh, is he okay? Or is so, he or she? Yes. Uh, I'm hoping that he's okay. Okay. So that Did is he need the type medical of behavior attention? that uh, rises to the level of concerns about mm -hmm. everybody's safety. Right. So nobody. Okay. Is the legislature in session? Assault? What was that? Uh, not to my knowledge right now. Oh yeah. Okay. Somebody was charged with assault. What so, exactly was? was I need to pull the chief away. You know. It's, hey. Somebody was charged with assault. And was there? What was the situation? Where somebody assaulted a trooper. What was the contact? What was, the, well, what that's was happening? All, Were that's they being all, arrested? That's they all something away? that's involved with the person who was arrested. Well, like, I need to pull the chief away, but if you think about it for a minute, him stopping to talk to you, as chief of the Washington State Patrol, he's stopping to ask, answer your questions. We aren't adversaries. We want an opportunity to talk to you. We, we can't win an argument with you. Right. It is, it is what it is. The building's closed for public safety. We had issues here to deal with. I mean, with you're the today. ones closing the building. Uh, you, know, so. you said that GA was that's the one who made the. I heard that G, right? from a state no, patrol that, that GA was, was the one who was. That GA was the one who made the decision, yeah. right? I, yes. I heard that in. I, I, I heard from the GA. I have GA I on film saying that it was the state patrol decision. Me too. Decision. Yes. Well, so guys, can we get? Well, bottom can we talk line, to somebody the from GA? Closed, can we talk to somebody from GA about that? It's only closed because you won't open it, though. Yeah, yeah. that's true. Can, so, <laughs> that's true. Yes. Uh, hey, uh, <laughs> thank you for talking with us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're here for you. We want you to have a good retirement, and we want you to be able to put your kids through college. That's why we're here. So I'm gonna go in and see if I can get somebody from GA. Woo! Uh, we need yeah. somebody from GA. Jim, ask Jim. It's GA ask for Jim. Ask for Jim. Can the people call media? Does What's anyone have contact? Let's go in. Fred. Uh, ask for Jim. 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 Ask for Jim. Jim. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Tell everyone inside hello for us. We will. Hey, how you doing? Also, we had a good one going earlier. Taxi cab. It's pretty loud. Yeah, I lobby for taxi cab drivers. Uh, well, I, I lobby like for 1,200 like small businesses that operate taxi cabs. Okay? Really? Do they uh -huh. pay their taxes? <laughs> yes, they do pay their taxes. Yeah. Pay their Whoa! Taxes. Oh, yeah. Do we have another pizza? <laughs> nice! Thank you! Thank you! Who's, who's it? Hold on, hold on. Hold on, from Maxwell. Maxwell. Everyone say thank you, Maxwell. Thank you, Maxwell. You want some cut? Would you like a flyer? No? Okay, that's good. Thank you. What's up, brother? She's the head of GA. Hi. Hi. So, I understand everybody here. Okay, they are excluding us. As of, I don't know what time, I got working here uh, at 5. Or so. They took one look at me and decided because I'm obviously not a lobbyist, I'm, you know, whatever, low income, I'm a normal person. No, they are excluding. And here's the thing, it's illegal. It is. They cannot assume that house doesn't close till 7. They are assuming that one of the WAFs is going to be broken, or one of the some other law is going to be broken before the fact. Yeah. And that is illegal. We're here to promote they cannot do that. So that has been upheld. And it hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Hang on. Stop, 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 stop. Hang on. We would also like to point out. We would also like to point out that none of nobody here was here earlier when everything went down. We are not affiliated with SEIU or any of them in any right. way. I was at all. here, but I was just watching from. They afar. are. 
You and me are supposed to be upholding the, the laws of Washington State, the WAC, as well as the Constitution, and you guys are breaking those laws arbitrarily and discriminating against people because of class issues. We are following the law. Thank you. Thank you. That is something that we, as the landlord of the of the, of the building, have to You are to not the landlord of the building. You're not the American public, Washington citizens, are the landlords of this building. Today. And as you all know, we had quite an incident in the building today where folks' safety was in question. As such, there was a feeling that there needed to be a cooling off period, and a decision was made to close the building. There's no cooling out part of democracy. Democracy happens the entire time. It's beautiful. It's, just like it's so beautiful what's happening right here. So are there secrets behind those doors if, he, if we weren't allowed in there today? Go so fight for us, Craig. We need to, we need to shake down the pages. That's what they want from lawmakers, <laughs> and you're not allowing us. <laughs> that gives priority right? to the money. Oh, yeah, that my is head, against man. the law. Yeah. So it would be one thing yeah. if everybody yeah. was disallowed, yeah. so but it's not everybody. Yeah. Either lock it down for everybody or let us all in. Yeah. Because you are breaking Is it because law. I'm not representing a corporation, I can't go in that building? We are trying to recognize people. You're discriminating against that kind of thing. If I had a Rolex on, totally illegal. No. I look no. like a lobbyist. No. I'm not doing this. No. Go call the National Lawyers Guild and ask them. We all are. You guys need some really fun. I have a. So, what's your name? What's your name? My name is Joyce Turner. Joyce Turner? Yes. Okay, I'm giving my civil rights attorney your name. Okay, that's great. <laughs> Is that the decisions that they make here are very well planned, and I don't, I'm not actually going to blame her for the decision that was made, but I think that we should remember that we're there, that they will do anything to divide us from each other. Yeah, we're there. Your interests are the same as ours, no matter where we stand. Our interests are the same as the public. But I, but not to say that you don't aren't, uh, you aren't like a part of the decision making process like I won't deny that and I think that you are that you should we should like you paid a whole lot of money but you right no I think I the constitution or the law but the real the, I mean the real thing is is that we either want to be let in or we want to make sure that private interests aren't the only voices being represented in state government while decisions critical decisions are being made about the thank future you. of our that's state corruption. thank you that's corruption well, and, definition. and we we walk a fine line trying to make sure that all first amendment <laughs> rights are You're protected are <laughs> <You're protecting laughs> the the rights of the but, moneyed class and not of us, the constituents. But also the safety of the, of the folks in the building as well. We don't intend to hurt anybody. We are all peaceful peaceful We don't intend to have... I'll go in there in my underwear. No one was yeah. here talking. Yeah. I don't know who's using their meeting senator or their meeting a representative. We have a specific reason to be here. But you don't have appointments. If you had a specific appointment, if you had a specific reason, that would be different. The building is locked down now, and and I'm sorry, you guys. We'll, we'll, we'll reopen the building in the morning. I'm sorry it doesn't really make up for the fact that you won't acknowledge that you are allowing needed, corporate interests to have a voice. You, you know what? We're not going to agree here, down. and I'm sorry. We're not going to agree. The First here. Amendment applies to certain people, but not me. And no, I am the first, I do have. But okay, I'm sorry. So this, is, this should be on the, the headlines, national headlines. The first what's amendment going on here? This is messed but, up. But but I have a responsibility. I have an absolute responsibility to, to uphold the Constitution, to exactly. ensure the safety and the security of this building, and to the tenants have, of this building. A, you, and right as a result, we had we had a reason today to have to lock down the building. We have made a decision we've cooled to keep. Down, though. Let we've us made a decision you know to you keep the building locked down the answer, for the rest of the day. So Our legislators is paid lobbyists. How many paid lobbyists are out here right now? Just raise one. your hand. Wait, one. there's one right in your face. <laughs> <laughs> Show the good guy. <laughs> Everybody's locked out of the building except for who? Paid lobbyists. Paid lobbyists and legislators. BS. Wait, wait, wait. So, so, so the paid lobbyists have have more pull in politics in Washington State than we the constituents. I don't know. The paid lobbyists are in there. I'm out I here. Can't. So what is that? I keep thinking if I walk down the hall inside the Capitol, the paid lobbyists are going to jump on me. You guys will talk to me. Let's <laughs> <laughs> so, so who are you? Sorry. My name is Craig Pridemore, Washington State Senator from Vancouver, 49th Legislature. Like All right, thank you. Calls, get some more people out here. <laughs> we just got an appointment. We're we're gonna try going inside. Oh, cool. Yeah, about letting us back into the cabin.
with our right. meeting with. Madam what? 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 Excuse me, I have a meeting with Craig Pride Woo! <laughs> 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 Make sure everyone gets in, everyone can fit in. Yeah, we can't walk in the way so we don't get through. Can you let me out? Everyone in. Yeah. What are we doing? Anybody cold back there? Yes. 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 I have to use the bathroom. There's a public restroom in this building. Oh, we're here for the American people. Thank you. 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 Oh. 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 So we actually ran for Congress last year. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's let this person through. <laughs> Someone's getting through. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's a wall of people. Oh. <laughs> like, Getting an appointment. What is this thing? We are fueled by the pizza from Wisconsin. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Numbered, guys. They've almost got us out numbered. There we go. Look at that. There's Big strong men with guns. Come on. This building. Is that right? Just so you know, there's about 10 cops. So, so they're not even, they're <laughs> wanting to say who can or who. Hey guys, they, they won't even say a name. Yeah, right. I'll get you a date with my sister. Alright, <laughs> 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 let's go back outside. I'm with you guys. Hey, how about we say that inside of your Whose side are you on? 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 Let this man. I don't like this though, man. Why? Like now we're going here. Like, you are wonderful, man. Thank you. Thank you. We love you. Thank you. Thank you. Time, uh, you can have a seat in the hearing room. Just uh, mellow on a little bit. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Excuse me. So you're going to get to a meeting? Yeah. 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 Everybody stay clean. No garbage. So who's in charge of this party? We all are. We're all in charge. <laughs> <laughs> How many people in the room have health care? Nope. 
the one that's right next to the entrance. Yeah, yeah, let's go raise our hands. We do. So we have no health care. What else is going on? My food no, not there's no, there's not enough jobs. How many people are looking for jobs right now? Here can't find the government employees. I thought the only people who were complaining about cuts to services were government employees. Yeah. No. Not all government employees? But you're not now. Nope. Not now. So you're not here because you have jobs and you just want to get a pay raise, right? No, I'm here because if I have children, I want to know they'll get a decent education in this country. So when I read the newspapers... because I want justice for the people. There you go. When I read the newspapers, all I hear is that it's all, it's all uh, county, state employees, public employees. They're the only ones that are protesting about some of the things going on today. Not the case, is it? No. no. So we got, we got no health care. We got no uh, jobs. What else we got? Well, problems? Most aggressive taxes in the United States. I can't afford to go back to college next year. Me either. Me neither. College costs going up. They're about to go up even more with this budget we're about to do. Twenty-five million in financial aid cuts to Washington students. Most recessive tax system in the country. This state, this state taxes poor people at a higher rate than any other state in the country. We tax wealthy people at the lowest rate of any other state. We're cutting the social services that allows poor people to actually work, which would increase your tax base. Or eat. And then we are They're not solutions at all. We in the United States are spending trillions and trillions of dollars for an illegal and unjust war and occupation. Yeah. Several of Woo! You need to bring that money and keep it home. I mean, yeah. Yes, we do. In the wars. Sure, it's kind of a little tough for me in the what legislature to be able to deal with that problem. <laughs> money from the feds if it weren't for that trillion plus dollar war. Right. So it's not as though the state has nothing it, to do with it. The state we certainly impacted by it. And they also have control of national government. Hey, we could just keep printing more money to fund it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what I see is we've got plenty of money to build this fancy new rotunda huh? thingy down there, but we don't the have enough money. What? The traffic circle. The traffic circle, yeah. yes. But we don't have enough money to, as an example, keep um, services being provided to like developmentally disabled adults and children Thank you. that like they need Thank in you. order to live like healthy independent lives. You guys know who this is? No. Senator Adam yeah. Klein from yeah. Seattle. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Earlier, Senator Marilyn Chase. Woo! Nelson is planning to come back, and we're hoping to get some more senators here. Or so, money to pay yeah. for hours for home care for an individual. So now she's moved out of her home to a nursing home, which costs much, much more. And she's gone ahead and gotten an infection in there that may end up killing her. But they couldn't give her home hours so that her home care workers. And the current proposal is to give even fewer hours. That's right. Well, they just got caught. That's yeah. why she got well, caught. Well, they're going to go to the government. Make it okay. different. Corporate tax is different. Distinguishing they, they, that from public tax. The people. We don't have let me ask some of the people, though, that I was talking to last night. Oh, God knows, late last night at the rotunda. Mm -hmm. yes. If we get a rotunda, uh, if we get a rotunda, if we get a referendum out there, and that's going to be a hard job in itself, if we do succeed in getting a referendum out there, are you going to be doing the hard political work of knocking on doors, getting people out to vote, yes. making sure everybody in your class, everybody you know at work, Everybody you know in your neighborhood is out there to vote. Are you going to be doing that? Yep. Yes. yes. All right. That's what I want to hear. But they're going to have truckloads of money against us. Yes. Yeah. That's right. So I shitloads of money against us. I have one one quick question. But you got the people's vote. What's your position on corporate personhood? I believe it's a mistake and made in 1871 and should have been undone years ago. So that we can be part yeah. of this process, I'd like to know what. I don't know. It's on the agenda. What today. Know. Well, let's you know, hey, I just got word. A, a bunch of votes on issues. The, the Senate is refusing to take any action until the public is allowed back inside. Woo! 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 Yeah. So we just found out that the uh, Senate went back into session. Um, we're actually in a building adjacent to the uh, Capitol building, uh, the dome. Um, I guess we kind of reached an agreement. Um, 
they decided to open the Capitol back up to us um, since Senate went back into session. Uh, it's about a quarter to eight right now. So we're going to see what happens. But. Okay, so uh, That's the news right now. Uh, promise was kept. We are inside the main building here, the Capitol building. Uh, there's the dome right there behind me. So we made it in here. Um, We've got a pretty large group. A lot of these guys are going to stick it out. This is supposed to be a week-long occupation. Uh, Senate is in session right now. As you can see, uh, they got a live feed TV there. So, oh, we got some peace. <laughs> so, promise was kept. People, we got some love. We got a lot of love. All right. <laughs> but uh, we're inside the house. Everybody's going to sleep here. Um, once again, I'm going to go home tonight. Get the photos on. Get the video on. So. Um, things are pretty well locked down here. We're only allowed to be in a certain area. Things are roped off. But, uh, I mean, I think we won this tonight. And we're going to keep winning. So, all you guys that are supposed to be here Friday, that's tomorrow. You better be here. Let's keep this going. We need to be heard and we need to uh, have justice. Uh, my name is Devin again. I'm with US Uncut. And we are in the Capitol Building in Olympia, Washington. That's all right. So going on behind me is uh, State Patrol is telling us we can sleep in the building again tonight. Um, we just need to be peaceful, clean, keep the house clean, um, and whatnot. So this is uh, great news. Uh, we're going to keep this uh, occupation going, and hopefully tomorrow um, we'll have a lot of people out here. So anyway, uh, this will probably be my last video. I'm almost out of memory. Um, I'm going to head home and edit this stuff out and get it out to everyone. Um, thanks again, Wisconsin, for all the pizza today. That kept us strong and uh, made us very happy. So anyway, thank you. Good night.